Oh, hey, didn't notice you there. I was just enjoying a nice cup of lemon ginger chamomile tea. Well, uh, welcome back, my uh, scrappy doodlers, or maybe scrappy diddlers. No, no, no! Nah, I don't think that'll work. Um, you came here for one reason, and it was because of the thumbnail, and it was movements to get strong with kettlebells. It's strength. You came here because you want more strength. You came here because you wanted to get stronger than you were the day before, and you want to do it with kettlebells. But strength isn't your strength. So, fuck the tea, load up on the protein powder and pre-workout, and let's fucking get after it. What is up, guys? Uh, we are going to get right into it. We are going to gain some strength here, some power. Uh, this is going to be some superhero strength. Uh, some of that, uh, what you'd picture, the look we're going for is what Batman would look like if he wasn't wearing a shirt. You know, that kind of a thing. You know, that comic book character, uh, that Wolverine chiseled look. Um, and this is how we're going to get there. We're going to start off with deadlifts. I've been doing a lot of deadlifts in a offset fashion. I don't think I've done an even one for about a month or two now. I've been doing them all uh, either with offset weights like I'm doing there with uh, 32 and 24. Uh, and I like to take the heavier side. Um, you know, I, I alternate the rounds a little bit. This is more of a sumo style deadlift. Uh, and I like to alternate them where I put the heavy side on the uh, outside of my foot. Um, really, really hits a different spot. Love it. Um, also got some new camera angles. I don't know if you guys noticed that. That's pretty damn cool. But, uh, yeah, this is uh, going to flip back over here. Really cool. Um, one thing I really, really want to recommend to you guys, um, whether you uh, whether you plan on sharing it with anybody or not, um, film yourself. Film yourself. Watch the way your technique looks. Uh, it might it might uh, make you uh, have a whole better understanding of a movement. Here we did a uh, moving target kind of a complex here, uh, and it started with uh, it was always with three swings, um, and I believe it was three swings. Maybe it's just one swing. Let's see here. Yeah, just one swing, uh, and it started with uh, three presses and one squat then a swing, then two presses, two squats, and then a swing and one uh, one set of uh, alternating, you know, like a seesaw press and three squats. Um, really, really like this kind of stuff. Don't be afraid to mix it up, man. Just get it in. Uh, you will be very, very surprised at the end what your reps are uh, versus just doing, you know, a certain a number of reps and that's it and then move on to the next thing. Um, this is about having fun. This is sustainability here, guys. Like, how do we keep doing this over and over again and not get bored of it? Um, not get, you know, complacent. Uh, that's that flow state, you know. I try to be in a flow state every single night um, and, and challenge myself in different ways and come up with new things. Here are some curtsy lunges. I have also been doing a lot more curtsy lunges. Uh, one of those things that I really enjoy for the stretch of it. You know, the stretch is just really, really nice. And um, not really able to get into it on my own without the weight. You know, the weight does add a little bit to it. Um, some might say that's not a good idea. Uh, but as long as it's still feeling good, I, I just kind of keep doing it. Really works the hamstring and the glute in a different kind of way, and it really hits that like outer section of the quad. Um, I, I, I think personally that they help with stability. Um, and if nothing else, they show you where you are unstable, like for instance, on my left side, how I can be um, kind of kind of unstable there. So... We're going to let these kind of play out here. we got a few more to go. I did this as a like a ladder down. Um, it was four reps. Uh, you know, and, and another thing to think here, right? So when you do this like ladder down, it's kind of, you kind of forget that you're doing it. But there's still a swing. And, you know, an alternating, you know, a swing to the other hand and a clean on each one. So if you did four, three, two, one, uh, there's 
going to be two on each of those. So you've got fourth, seven, eight, nine, ten. So you still have ten alternating swings and cleans, which that's not really what this was about, was it? But they still ended up in there. Um, kind of keeps that heart rate moving. Uh, another thing I've kind of become a little more committed to doing, um, I'll be the first to say I am not a clubist or a macist. I, I struggle sometimes with the movements. It's mostly in shoulder mobility. Another thing that I really do for for the stretch of it, this stretch just feels so good. Um, you'll see me kind of pause when I get to that swing over and swing over and it's that pause is me just kind of stretching out my um uh, my shoulder in a way that I wouldn't usually do it you know um and for some reason I I don't do it and I can't find that same position without doing it this way so uh kind of interesting there I'm gonna let these I'm gonna let these play out for a second here and did kind of this overhead shield cast another thing I really do for the for the stretch of it here. Here we go, the Imam that uh, I've noticed all you guys have been waiting for. This seems to be the most watched parts of my videos. I think I might put a uh, Imam's greatest hits together, but it was a uh, Renegade Row. So this is the same, the same one, just a different camera angle. Renegade Row, Renegade Row. Then we pop up in a burpee kind of a manner. We kind of sumo squat that there. Then hang clean, hang clean double hang clean and two presses one 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 awesome imam um guys if you like what i am doing if it is something once again if i'm earning um you know earning something from you if i'm adding value uh please please subscribe you know share this all that good stuff like it 